All right, good morning. Day three of painting. This is going to be a fairly simple day because we're starting to get into some details. So, yes, you may. Okay, so we're going to start our pier today, and we're going to start it. We're going to make life a little easier for you. We're going to start using masking tape on our painting. Okay, masking tape. You need you know, mask to cover something. You wear a mask covering your face. We're going to cover parts of our canvas, not only to help us make a shape that we want to make, make it look real nice, and also make sure we get paint where we want to get it and don't get paint where we don't. Okay, so today's going to be a little messy. Um, on purpose. Okay, so I'm going to pull a couple pieces of tape and I'll show you what kind of shape I'm going for here. So on this left side, I'm going with a slightly diagonal piece from left to center. It's slightly diagonal. Okay, I'm going to go with a few pieces. And I'll show you what we're going to do. Okay. So if you want to make something with a hard edge, this is this is the way you want to do it, okay? Now I'm putting down another piece right underneath it, but the difference is it's a little wider here than it is there because the pier here is closer than the pier over there, okay? Let's get a little piece to close it, all right? Just a little piece to close it. So the main part of our pier is going to be right there, okay? And it's masked, so it's ready to go. I'm also just going to get a couple more pieces. I'm just going to get one more big piece, and uh, maybe two more. But what we're going to do, too, is we're going to use this to kind of mark something, okay? So I got another piece that's in the ocean, and it's covering up a little bit of that. We're not going to, we don't want that to get covered, okay? We're going to do something over here. And then I'm just going to get a vertical piece right there. So, let me grab a pencil quick, too. What we can do now is this is going to be the walkway on the pier, okay? What's going to be down here is going to be the cross beams and things for the pier itself, okay? You can use a pencil to draw this part before you paint it. So we're kind of at a place where you're allowed to draw stuff now because now we're getting into detail. All right, but let's just get down to the easy stuff. We're going to paint right here. What I really want you to do when you put down this masking tape, I just want you to rub the edges real good so that no paint seeps under. I don't need you crying on me, okay? So I've got a cutter here. You guys want to get started on that. Maybe you just take one big old piece and then you can rip it from there if you want to. Okay, so here I go. I'm just going to take black and this little shape I made here, I'm going to fill it and then I'm going to peel up that tape, okay? So just like this. Here we go. So again, I did all my, and you know what, guys, I, being an artist, not all that fun sometimes, because people think you can do things that you don't want to do, okay, like painting pencils, all right, I hate painting pencils, but I had to get good at it, because I'm a homeowner, and because everyone asks, okay, but the one thing I did learn is, you know, the painting's not the hard part, you know, none of it's really hard. If you want to have a tough time of painting something, like a room or anything, then do a bad job at prep work, okay? If you do a great job at prep work, it's not even a job at all, okay? Taping down whatever you need to tape down, just getting sure the floor is all set so you don't have to worry about dripping paint or anything. So the better your prep work is, the better off you're going to be total. I'm not going to wait for this to dry. I'm peeling this up right now, okay? So right here in this area I masked, I wanted some sharp lines, and I got them, okay? Now, what I'll also do, I think now I'll upload the picture of what we're doing, the Sunset Pier on Classroom, 
so that you can see what the cross beams and all look at. Maybe I'll work on that a little bit, but I actually want to get out here and help these kids. Okay? Crisp. Don't look too impressed, Taylor. Okay, thanks. Um, so there we go. Now from there, you've got the cross lines for the actual pier, okay? So there will be some that are just going straight down into the water. There are some that might be making X. They can start fatter here and get skinnier as they go down. And they're going to get a little smaller as they go down too, okay? So that's today, learning to mask to make a sharp, nice, clean object. We'll work that, and you'll see some pictures up soon, and we'll do one more video tomorrow. Have a nice day.